All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duel. So, if you look at the title, don't let it freak you out. You know, I'm not quitting Yu-Gi-Oh! for the channel life. Uh, I just, it's just simply a discussion that I wanted to go ahead and talk about because a lot of, uh, you know, Yugi tubers lately have been doing a lot of quitting lately. There's a lot of quitting going around. So I just wanted to go ahead and discuss it. A lot of quitting, a lot of returning, and it's, it's, it's been the big thing in, in Yu-Gi-Oh! Yugi tubing community. Uh, if you guys might remember, maybe a couple months ago, uh, I pretty much quit Yu-Gi-Oh! when it comes to playing in real life, when it comes to purchasing decks, going to locals, doing all that thing. And there's a couple of YouTubers that are actually uh, following suit. I mean, not following me, but doing the, the same thing. Uh, you guys might not know this, but Underground members Kisame actually decided that uh, he is done as well when it comes to collecting cards, dueling in real life. Now, that doesn't mean that, you know, we're quitting our uh, YouTube channels, because, I mean, I, I really can't say for them per se, but definitely for me, I mean, I don't really have to go too much out of my way. I don't know why whenever I duel against anything that runs Charger Light Brigade, they always get their two Charger Light Brigades. Like, always open up with it. Like, this is gonna be a really difficult duel. <laughs> he didn't mill too many Infernoids, so I at least appreciate that, but this is still gonna be a pretty difficult duel. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. Uh, I got Strix. Uh, Impale Laney, this isn't gonna be much. Sharplanius? Did they change his name? I thought it was Impalanius, but Sharplanius? Like, alright. Uh, this, this might be a tough one. Uh, I got some back row, which is nice. And still not milling the best of cards, really. I'm gonna go ahead and pack into my Mimicry Lanius. That's fine. You go ahead and take that 200. I don't need to summon you. <laughs> now if I can go ahead and get my, uh, my rank up cards, then that'd be great. But without any rank up cards, once again, this, I'm not really doing much with this freaking deck. And this, it really seems like this guy's running a lot of freaking back row. Like, holy crap. So, I guess I can. I could just go ahead and summon Impale Anius and turn your defense mode attack you. So I guess I'll go ahead and special summon Fuzzy, XCU2, uh, CU2, Detach. I kind of want to detach uh, Mimicry. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do that, so. We should have some plays, which is nice, it's nice. Uh, it would be nice to detach Fuzzy, but I think I want to detach Mimicry just to banish it and get that search, so... I'll go ahead and summon Force Tricks. Force Tricks, he took it really passively, I thought he was going to overextend a little bit more, so... The problem is I let him get set up because of that, which is, isn't good, it really isn't. Uh, so... He's going to go ahead and search me for any monster. Uh... I guess I'll just start grabbing my boost now, because I kind of have a feeling that he's going to fuck me up. So, so then we'll go ahead and normal summon Impale, activate Impale, turn you to defense mode, and then just run you over. And then summon me back uh, one of my uh, monsters. Oh, obviously I should go ahead and give him my Mimicry search. Duh. So Mimicry, go ahead and search me for Nest. I have two. And just search it up, like, just search that deck. But uh, just a lot of quitting lately. A lot of quitting, a lot of returning. A lot of breaks. I mean, Yu-Gi-Oh! It, it's it really sometimes it just feels like that game, that game where you just you just need a break, you know? It's like I I, I just can't I can't eat them at times. Uh, I already used you. I'm gonna go ahead and summon back with. Oh wait, I'm not gonna have anything to summon back with because I just banished my shit. That was dumb. I should have attacked first. Definitely should have attacked first. Uh, so I guess I don't really have a choice. I guess I gotta get uh, singing would be pretty good. Like, that was dumb. I uh, definitely should have did that properly, so I guess I'll just attack over you. Because I don't want Dragon to survive, but I should have did all this in main phase too. I should attack someone back and then get all that. Oops. I was like, oh yeah, I definitely want to get that search, so... But that was dumb. That was really dumb. Uh, but who said I was ever perfect with this deck? No one ever, and the likes of Neverness. <laughs> Alright, go ahead and make another Strix. Get another search. Uh, who would be pretty good to get? Who would be pretty good to get? Another. Can I only use boost once per turn? No, boost is once per turn. Another boost. Fuck it. If he's gonna fuck up my fucking tricks and shit, then I might as well get all the boosts I can. Boost wins duels. Boost wins fucking duels, man. I love boost. <laughs> but he, he has a nice check as Infernoid monsters, I must say. You know, I can. I definitely don't mind stopping like a a, a Nuchu banish. Like, he's gonna banish a whole bunch to summon like a Nuchu and wipe me. Like, nah, 
I'm good. I'll go ahead and just hit you with that solemn notice, solemn strike. But uh, another thing uh, with, uh, with a lot of YouTubers quitting, uh, one, win more card, win more card, fucking reasoning, let's go. <laughs> oh, fucking dream, yep, kind of forgot about that card. I could just summon a, send a butt ton of Infernoid monsters. What imagination, what's level? Well, you can send this card to the use them here. The extra deck, and if your opponent has a monster to special summon from the extra deck, then he can go ahead and do that shenanigans too. Uh, if I Icarus attack now, so he's just building up so many freaking Inferno Like that's the problem right now. And I'm not getting shit. Like, where are my rank up cards? Where's any of them? Nowhere to be found. Like, all right. <laughs> Like maybe I should just put them and put them down to one just so I can draw them with the number generator because I am not getting them. <laughs> so go ahead and send your imagination. What? You're not going to send your imagination? Alright, so if you're not going to do that, then I'm going to go ahead and hit you with the Icarus attack. You're probably going to go ahead and block with your trap card. That's fine, but at least I get rid of your imagination. Go ahead and block. I mean, go ahead and block with your spell. That's fine. Because I'd rather have your imagination gone and select two targets and popping one of my own things than you just going imagination. Let me go ahead and use a whole bunch of infernoids from my deck. So, Fuzzy, go ahead and get that search on. So, you're just the one that pops back row, right? Yeah. Just gonna turn him into the one that pops back row. I guess that's fine. I'm deck thing like crazy is just on one of my rink up cards, whether it be, you know. That means I'm an ultimate falcon. If I was on an ultimate falcon, I think that might be game. Like, I don't think Infernoids can beat ultimate falcon, but I guess we'll just find out. So I guess we'll go ahead and use Patrulli Effect and pop my back row. And I'll tell you the truth, I'd rather just use it than keep you there, especially with how this deck likes to like suppress them into like Omega and shit. Like, I'd rather you just be gone. And now it is definitely time to get it. Like, Let's see if he summons a new chew. If he summons a new chew and just wipes me, because I believe a new chew is the one that wipes monsters, right? Then I'm dead and my boosts are useless. But if he doesn't and he tries to attack me, then I do got boost. So that's not terrible. I just need a rank up card, whether it be, you know, half my life points, shave force, or whatever. Just sometimes I don't get any fucking rank up cards. This goddamn pack sucks. <laughs> I'm running rank up cards, back row, monsters to search, and it's just like, nah, you're not gonna get any of that. <laughs> but uh, a lot of taking breaks. Uh, we have a couple of Yugi tubers who are supposedly coming back, but it's just now it's just hard to tell if they're gonna keep their promise and actually come back, just because, you know, how into the game are they? That, that's definitely uh, a question that can be asked. You know, what, what, what are they really into it? Like. Uh, I believe, like, your Yu-Gi-Oh! channel said, uh, you know, I'm back, you know, I got my shit stolen, but I'm back, and then, not a lot of uploads. Uh, Underground, uh, Underworld 6667 goes away for months, and then all of a sudden there's a video on bags that slam, just, you know, just a, a nice chunk of just, uh, yu tubers that are like, you know, I'm gone, and then, uh, no, I'm back. And it's just like, you know, are you really back? Are you seriously here? Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of you. I know you only have one, unless you have another one in your hand, of course. So, we'll just go ahead and boost pop you. Yep, okay, you have another one. Now, yeah. at least this, this guy, I mean, this man is fucking getting all his fucking cards. I'm gonna go ahead and just summon you, because I'm gonna die anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna die. This card dies, you banish one card in the field, so. Yeah, I'll go ahead and just summon you. I'm dead, so that means he's gonna come at me with a new chill and then I can- Oh, never mind, because he gets to play the fucking shit again. Like, oh my god. Ah, he opened up really well. Like, he, he charred, double charged, drew into his spells, just- And there's not a lot of Infernoid monsters that he's played, either. He get, he, he's playing a lot of spells in comparison to his Infernoid monsters. He's got everything. Where's my rank of cards? Nowhere to be fucking found. Nowhere to be goddamn found. Wow, he timed out. <laughs> Yeah, that duel was not in my favor. I didn't give me rank up cards. If I could have made Ultimate Falcon, that probably would have been game. Like they, you know, they can handle towers, sure. You know, some Anuchi wipe towers. I mean, but that's banned. But fucking Megazord or Ultimate Falcon? No, they can't handle that. It's too strong. All right, let's get another duel. Bear back. 
All right, another duel. Hopefully, I, I at least get one rank up card. Like, if I just get one, then the duel is much better. I didn't get any. <laughs> Actually, I opened up fucking terrible, terrible. Like, I, there's a lot that I need to make this fucking hand a lot better. It would've been probably would've been better if I went first. Wow, he's playing freaking Power Rangers. M for one. Yep. Like, I'll send Mally with the Power Rangers. Like, this man's gonna be doing some serious synchro or something. He's gonna be bust something sick. He's like, I saw. Resort. Uh, there's some nut jet, like, mm -mm 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 -mm. and I'm glad I'm getting my fucking last tricks, that's nice and all, it's just, I would love to get my fucking rank up cards, like, give me that fucking, uh, like, it's literally a two card fucking ultimate falcon, but I need the two cards, <laughs> like, holy shit, <laughs> now, now I'm just desperate to get anything, like, I, I literally need a rank up card, like, a, wow, and he's just going in, like, look at this, look at this, he's using every single card in this, in his hand to go off. He's literally used everything. So, I'm probably gonna get it. I'm probably gonna end up getting it. Oh, it would've been nice if I would've went first and had this solemn strike ready to go, but... <laughs> but it's just, you know, how much effort are you really willing to put into the game, and how how willing are you in to stay in it, you know? The time and effort and the money, it's just this, this game. It's expensive, it really is. So there's that broken ass TG Hyper Librarian, so he'll probably, despite using up all the cards in his hand, probably drop a shit storm. I wouldn't be surprised if you first turn Quasar's me my ass any, anyway, actually. Yep. 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 <laughs> yep. Summon that back. Think again. Oh, nope. Level E the level off up. I think he I think he has first turn Quasar. There's the possibility. One, two, three, da, 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 da. No. Wow, double draw. Yep, yep, double draw. He used up all the cards in his hand, and he's gone through 13 cards in his deck, but yeah, that's fair. <laughs> like, dude, you don't even have to worry about me. Like, unless I draw fucking... Unless I draw Skip Force. Shit, you don't have to worry about me. I don't like, garbage. <laughs> yeah, go ahead and eat a level off. Using Shadow Level Eater and all that good shit. He opened up the tits. He opened up the tits. You know, yeah, he, he used every single card in his hand to pull off these plays. Like, look at this shit. Draw again. Oh, some of that fucking resonator. Ah, ah, just having fun watching, just sitting here watching this guy jerk it in my goddamn face. Just hurry up and make your goddamn quasar tuning. Yeah, of course. Yep. He's not done. He's not done. If you thought he was done, he ain't done. Like, there's a reason why I don't like fucking synchro decks. It's shit like this. <laughs> like, can I get my turn, please? This is boring. <laughs> He's jerking it for a quasar. Like, hopefully you at least summon quasar. I'm not even sure if you can do that. Well, you probably can. If you decrease this level by the appropriate choice. Then maybe eat a level off. No, he's gonna increase him to eight. Like, oh, okay. Like, where are we going with this? Where are we going with this, people? Okay. Draw another card. Look how many cards he's drawn off a of TG Hyper Iberian. Like, look at this shit. Yeah, this card can go up to multiples. Fuck that. Holy shit. He just keeps synchro summoning, keep plusing. Like, you're supposed to neg when you synchro summon. Uh. Thought he was gonna with all the shit he's done, I thought he was gonna make a quasar now. He, I guess he's not gonna make a quasar. Maybe you see? If that's what you wanna do after all the synchro and plays you've done. And he's just gonna leave it like that. Alright. Well, that's not what I needed at all. So but yeah, you probably got this. Sure. Go ahead and use Omega Effect, put something that's banished back in the graveyard. Of that plague spreader for more shenanigans next turn, I'm assuming. Or your... Or that. Yeah, I'll tell you, Jetson Crown. And I got nothing. <laughs> I opened up like fucking shit. Like, I opened up like trash, so I'm just gonna go ahead and scoop it up. And then we'll go ahead and get a different duel. Be right back. <sighs> so. Just, just a lot of quitting in Yu-Gi-Oh right now. Alright, Generator. Alright, well, at least I finally got my soul shaved. Just that'd be great if I could just go ahead and bust out my shit. But, this Generator's fucking me right now. 
Holy shit. I can always search this really easy, so I dropped it down to one because I really don't need one. I'm only playing one of this, true that. Dude, fucking just, like, come on. What the fuck? Like, why am I opening up so fucking ass with the Raid Rafter? Like, what the fuck is going on? Like, there's so many, I'm running so many cards that give me that additional summon just to play, just to give me an additional summon. That's really all I need. Is that a filled spell? Oh. Oh, it's like, what the fuck are you doing? I don't swamp, I can have that. That's what I'm mad at. Sure, whatever. I'm playing the Xe deck anyway, so. All I need is just to draw one of my many, 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 many monsters that allow me to get additional summon. Whether it be a normal summon, special summon, or whatever. No. Alright. Alright. Cool. Cool. So, I guess I'll just sit here. Now I'm getting all the rank up cards, but no Raid Raptors. Like, please, deck, cooperate with me. It's just shit like here, right here. It makes people want to quit damn Yu-Gi-Oh! So luck-based. <laughs> Ah, uh, like, am I gonna, am I gonna lose the fucking Venoms? I'm gonna lose the fucking Venoms because I can't draw shit. <laughs> wow, I'm gonna lose to a Venom Stealth Bird burn. Like, alright, let's go. <laughs> like, I, literally, all I need is just one fucking Raid Raptor that I can summon. Like, I'm running so many of them. Whether it be Fuzzy, or the fun one where I take life point damage and target another Raid Raptor monster. That's all I need. That's all I need. Thank you. Thank you. This ball's about to get rolling. I'm about to get in this duel. We'll go ahead and summon you, which I don't generally want to summon you, but I gotta summon you. At least you're four. Oh, now you want to play Maxi? What's the stats on this? 700? I might allow you to draw. I might allow you to draw. Because if I let you kill this, then I have nothing. I'll let you even out. I'll let you even out, because... I'm gonna get more bank than it's worth. I'm gonna leave it like this though. I'm gonna go ahead and search with Nest and leave it just like this. So, I guess I'll just go ahead and search Last Tricks because I already have my uh, Skip Force. Leave it just like that. I'm good. You can get one card because next turn I'm gonna be busting out that Ultimate Falcon, so. Sure, I'll take my fucking counters. Sure, I'll die. I don't really care. I really don't care. <laughs> Next turn is Ultimate Falcon time, people. Ultimate Falcon. Winning. Sure. Sure. Swords of Revealing Light. This card just say when it's into a right period. Uh, this this card is sent to the graveyard. Get add. I think it's just period. Is this summon like a monster or something? If I can play fucking. Oh, okay. Yeah. Go ahead and play this. I don't need this. We'll get rid of your swords and we'll get rid of your venom swab because that's getting annoying. And sure, of course I'll activate fuzzy and get the search. Ah, <laughs> uh, twin twister, I love you. <laughs> Next time, we'll just go ahead and summon that last trick, skip force, and then bam, there's Ultimate Falcon right there. Oh, and boost too. I'm gonna summon. Sure, another? Another one? I'll let you draw because at this point, you're really not gonna be doing much to me anymore. So we'll go ahead and summon that satellite. And skip force right into Ultimate Falcon. That or that. I guess I'll just go ahead and uh, second this. Kill that for me. Like what? Your limit area B is not doing anything. Oh, that's because I'm an C monster. So. Yep. So how about I start burning you now for a thousand? How's that sound? <laughs> I think that sounds like a pretty good idea. Look at this man trying to be cute. Uh, trying to use this fucking sacky ass fucking deck that he's trying to play. Uh, let me go ahead and burn you for a thousand. I'm unaffected by card effects, so you can't touch me worth a shit. I don't think I can. I don't think this affects the player. I mean, the card, I think, affects the player. I don't think I can get through that right now. That's fine, you know. 
I guess we can just go ahead and summon Boost, summon Fuzzy, get the, get another search, like... So you gonna drop Maxi on me again? Did, did you get all three Maxis? Oh, a Drama Trio. Alright. That's cute. So I guess I'll just start searching now, because I fucking can. I don't know what to search for, once again. I seriously doubt he's ever gonna attack into me. Like, I can just set the Icarus attack and fuck him up, so. I'm not even worried about that. I'm running this guy, because he's kinda like. It's kinda like the, uh, this and this for the additional summons. Which is a pretty good play, it's just. I don't really got anything to go with it. <laughs> I'm not sure if I can attack, because I think it affects the... Nope, I can still attack. I'd say. Like, does it affect the the, the player or the monster? Like, no, it affects the... Alright, so this man's literally just trying to stall out. What a fun duel. What a fun duel. <laughs> I mean, he's not going to last long. That's the sad thing. He's really not. So, I guess I'll go ahead and Icarus attack him. Let me go ahead and just... Now since you have the actual monster, I guess I'm not going to be really doing much. Alright, we'll get a whole bunch of poison counters, that's fine. Oh no, you killed my fucking boost tricks. That's fine. Sure. So, I'm definitely gonna kill you, and I'll probably kill you. Because these two are the like only threats. Oh, this. This isn't really a threat to him. Hey, more counters. Oh, what a fun duel. And by fun, I mean not really. Ooh, another Icarus attack. Alright, so definitely just go ahead and summon Icarus attack. I'll probably get rid of this, definitely. Maybe this? No, this. No, this. Because this and this really aren't a threat to me. This is kind of annoying, though. I guess I'll just go ahead and normal summon. Get my search again. I'll just keep searching. Just keep searching. Keep searching, yes, keep searching, 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 searching. Ah, if I can get a, get a mimicry, I guess. I'm gonna be Icarus attacking again next turn. Why not? Then, why don't you hold on to this Icarus attack? So I'm gonna get rid of that and get rid of that. Then, uh, I guess I'll just go ahead and slap you in the face for 35 and then burn you for a thousand. Like, ah, oh, this is a fun fucking duel, isn't it? Go ahead and play just the Scarecrow Battle Fate or something along those lines. Like, you're not dueling me, you're just trying to just really slowly burn me. I'm not gonna get to use this much anywhere else, so fuck it. You can catch that strike, take that 35. Like, ah. Oh. Feels so good just to fuck you up right now. <laughs> Joe Saki burn shit. Take that thousand for me. The battle for you there, I wanna block! I wanna block, I wanna survive! I'm burned! I'm burned! I'm gonna outsack you! Sure, keep paying. I'm gonna roll right through it. So you're gonna pad out of resources. You might as well just scoop it up now. Like. It's not done to fail, neither player can. So one of mine, one of yours, so I can't summon any more monsters. This man is literally just trying to lock me out of the fucking duel, which is great and all, but you see, I'm just gonna burn you out. Like, I can literally just go, end my turn, end the next game. <laughs> so. So, let's see, do you have the last battle fader, or am I just gonna attack directly for a game? Uh, Mr. Saki Sack? Uh, Mr. Saki Sack, huh? What's this do? Move all counters and inflict 700? Uh, you only have two counters, so... That's fine. Tag game? Tag game with your sacky ass? That's what you get, bitch. Uh, feels good. Feels good. All, all I really all I do is spend my turn burning for a thousand. Like, how do you like it getting burned, bitch? Like, look at this shit. Look at this sack shit. But it's, no, it's nothing compared to the power of Ultimate Falcon. 
so powerful. Two card fucking power, unaffected, 3500 monster, burns you and drops your attack. Like, yep, yep, yep. Or Megazord too. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Band towers make a strong, make two stronger towers. Good job. <laughs> anyway, so I just want to discuss that. Just tell me you YouTubers quitting, uh, leaving, coming back. Like, I straight up, if I go unannounced and disappear from YouTubing for like two months, like straight up, all of a sudden I'm not uploading to YouTube and it's been two months, just presume me dead. Because they're, they're, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm too responsible. Actually, like, this is a, a job pretty much, and there's no way like. I'm fired, pretty much. There's no, like, you can't, you can't have a job. You can't have like a desk job, not show up to work for two months and then expect to come back and have your job. You know, I'm explaining. They no, you, you're fired, pretty much. Like leave. So no, just, just presume me dead. If that, if, especially if I didn't upload a video announcing what's up, what's going on. Especially if that in two months, I'm dead. Simple as that. Because there's no way I'll allow myself to get that irresponsible. But hey, you know these bigger YouTubers, they they get big headed. They think that they can just do this shit. That they'll disappear for months on end and then come back and then think that, you know, they'll still have all the subscribers that they have. And probably they will, you know. There's a lot of either A, dead subscribers or just, you know, dead sub boxes, you know. You'll be subscribed to someone. Not everybody uploads as consistently, consistently as I do. You can, they will not upload in months on end and you'll still be subbed to them. And you'll, you won't get the content that you want. And then all of a sudden when they get the your content you want, you're like, oh, yay, welcome back. And it's just like, no, but where, where have you been? I said, this is very unacceptable. You're welcoming them back with open arms, and I just don't think that flies, in my personal opinion, but hey. So, uh, you know, you should only be subscribed to the consistent shit. And if you're not getting what you want, then unsubscribe. It's simple as that. But if you're just sitting there waiting, hoping, praying that they'll come back, then forget it, you know? Like, for example, Slate. What happened to him? I don't know. RJB0, what happened to him? I don't know. So... Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and call it an episode. So tell me what you guys think about people just quitting Yu-Gi-Oh and just quitting uh, Yu-Gi-Tubing in general. And tell me, are you guys still into Yu-Gi-Oh? Do you guys still buy cards, go down to your locals, go to regionals, YCSs, or is it plain, or is it just blatantly DM Dead Pro? That's it. You know, it, it's turned from more than a than an actual game that I play in real life, card-based game that I go down to locals and I'm just playing online for fun, just to kill time. So yeah. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching, people.